Hey everyone, Joe here. Let's take a look at how we can make a click track in Pro Tools. Now I'm using Pro Tools 11 on PC, but this will work on any version of Pro Tools on PC or Mac. And why would you want to use a click track? Well, it can help you to play in time, of course, and it will help to make sure everything's in time after it's been recorded. So let's get a click track on here. Now, the easiest way of doing this on Pro Tools is you just go straight to the track menu and you go, Create click track and it's as simple as that and then what that's going to do is it's going to create an instrument track for you with the click plugin already added on it's going to ghost out that solo button so it's always going to be on but with a control click or a command click you could change that let's have a listen and there we go now you can make plenty of changes to that. The default on Pro Tools 11 is the Click 2 plugin, so we can change that to uh, wood blocks, which I prefer, or any anything else, and then you can change the levels of the uh, the first click on the bar and the, the rest of the clicks. You can also change the timing of it, and by default it's going to follow the BPM that you've set in your tempo editor. Uh, you can draw in different tempos on there with the pencil tool. And if you're not seeing the tempo editor, just click on the horizontal menu uh, drop down and select tempo. I do prefer that wood block to that horrible beeping, but each to their own. Now, alternatively, you could create a new track. You can create an instrument track in mono or stereo. And if you have your own uh, click plugin that you prefer you can just add that on and most of them should follow the BPM in the same way as Pro Tools built-in click but I do tend to just go for that create click track option just because it's so much quicker and there you go that's how you create a click track in Pro Tools if you have any questions then just leave them in the comment section below and I will reply and if you want to see any more Pro Tools or editing and mixing tips just like this one hit that subscribe button and I'll see you next time